all cash, like crummy kind of guy, but it's the best sweet tea you've ever had in your life. at the airport heading down to Fort Myers, Florida. I got a, um, a few dirt projects down there. So I know a guy down there, you may, you may remember him a couple years ago from a video. So jump on a plane here. degrees flight the pilot wasn't that good he's kind of kind of rough we were kind of going all over this and that but we're in florida i think fort myers not really sure but it's hot the second i stepped out of the airport here it was like it felt like it was 200 degrees so i'm waiting for my ride i don't know if he can really get here he's in a big rig he's in a dirt mover so <laughs> of course so we'll see uh if he can get up here i'm up on that second level see if he can make it up here and uh, get a good bite to eat I'm starving few palm trees. It's kind of cool, I guess. Someone order an Uber? What's up, buddy? Next <laughs> <laughs> time, no see. Oh, man. Let's get out of here, dude. What up to? Oh, man, dude. Working. Working away? Where are we going? I don't know. Home, but they actually... <laughs> out of here before I get in trouble. <laughs> I don't think I should be here with this. I didn't see any signs, but I think it's just kind of common knowledge. You're not supposed to be at the airport and a dump truck. Right, right. I mean, so this guy's the one in my way now. He's in my turn lane. <laughs> He's in your turn lane? I think you're in his. No, I'm trying. They didn't make a turn lane for me when they made the road. Hey, it's right. Florida. You're not going to understand, dude. It's Florida. Right. Just gotta, that. I, I you got to make your own rules. Uh, this is a work truck. What kind of tin you got on this? Thing? I can't even see. Oh, uh, 5% of the sides. Nice. Wait. Now you got to be careful. You might have to keep it to watch it. No, no, 5% of the sides. 30 on the shield with a 5% strip. The whole shield's 30. <laughs> nice. I mean, um, it's hot during the day, man. It gets bright. Yeah, it is. It's only, what, March? And it already feels like it's like a million degrees. It was 92 today. All right, let's see how much I can do. south here they don't start early it's already like 10 o'clock and we're just getting rolling but apparently that's how they roll down here and then go haul some fill or black dirt or haul something somewhere stay tuned I don't think it's that much different. It's all block all the way up. Some shysty. Yeah. <laughs> Some shysty Home Depot spray foam. Uh, then did they put did they put any insulation here at all? No. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. So it's literally just block and sheetrock on this. Yeah, the the, the sheetrock just the insulation. Wow. Sheetrock is insulation too. This is how drywall gets mounted on wow. the spot right here onto the actual furniture. Wow. 
Yep. And, and then look, they don't even run them all the way up. Just call it, call it good at the top. Yeah. Well, that's how they run the electrical wires at the bottom. Oh, yeah. Too much work to cut through them. Yeah, like everything is just, you know, very minimal. Just all the gas stick on the bottom here, and we use the scrap wood and stuff. <laughs> Isn't really everything here cheap? Cheap as can be? Oh, yeah. It's insane cheap. <laughs> <laughs> it's a quality craftsmanship there. Yeah, like, wow. they started to cut this. They said, oh, wait, no, we need this. <laughs> this back of screws sitting around. Leftovers? I mean, the more you look at it, the more it hurts. Junk. The electrical work doesn't look too bad. Like they do, a good, like, it's all stapled and stuff. Half <laughs> this is all in Florida, like, but this is supposed to be their dumpster? Yeah, this is how you work for a cheap contract. Well, none of the garbage is in it in the first place. <laughs> it's just not even a bottom. <laughs> it's, just, it's just dirt. <laughs> but you're too cheap to get a dumpster. Yeah, what? It's, it's like four by eight plywood with a two by four. Some of them do. They just start chucking stuff in the weeds. Right. This is when they cleared the lot. They decided to hack. That's, 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 that's a hack way to do it instead of hauling it away. Next time we see a cleared lot, we'll show you how some of these guys do. They just chuck stuff off in the next It's funny. Cause I've seen this on I've seen this on every one. Either you throw it in, in the thing and then you start to pick up off the ground or you just throw it in the weeds. <laughs> it's all good. Oh, man. It's funny. Do you say this has to be like, all like hurricane proof too? That's a thick slab yeah. for an air conditioner. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This has to be able to withstand like 150 miles an hour. Everything here is built to withstand 150 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. It has to be able to withstand a like, category three hurricane possible. Mm -hmm. That's the code. So it's built just good enough. Right. It's just really crappy just craftsmanship. Barely. It really is no craftsmanship. <laughs> probably everybody put this together, probably not a single one has a green color. Yeah, so what we got here in front of us? Uh, uh, this guy right here, he's D7. This has a 3406 50 liter cat. Gorgeous out here. It's sunny and 70. Feels absolutely amazing. Um, I know guys down here from uh, just from the internet from around. So we're gonna come down for a little trip, just uh, have a little fun, see what the dirt world's like down here before we get really going, really busy up by us, uh, way up there, way up north there, uh, eight states up, however many it is. It's a beautiful day to move some dirt. It's all sand. Gorgeous sugar sand filter. Oh, Sleepy Joe back into something. He done did her good. Someone took out the gate. What are we doing here? Uh, this is just contract hauling. We're just moving uh, this way. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> this is the random track chilling there. <laughs> yeah, we're, 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 I'm just getting paid to move this. I don't ask what it is, I don't care. Move it point A to point B and get That's paid. It. That's it, get paid. There's a it's lot of fire. There's a lot of it here. Yeah. What do you call these things? A whack, uh, what was it, a whacker noodle? Yeah, a whacker noodle. So it's kind of just like the wild, wild west down here just because there's minimal DOT, minimal OSHA, and everything else. It's like there's a random excavator track chilling here. I, mean, I guess this was a bunch of crap from the hurricane uh, a few years ago. My buddy Adam was showing me they had an excavator here they were loading all the trucks with that. They, they were running it without the tracks. The tracks were sitting here and they're just rolling around on the idlers, <laughs> driving around this pit, literally loading trucks with an excavator, driving around with no tracks. That's like, that's crazy. You'd never see that up by us. We got this little Wacker Noodle, uh, Wacker Nissan, Nissan, whatever it is. It's like the smallest bucket on planet, planet Earth. It's like a little tile bucket, but hey, it's all we got. I'm not exactly sure what he's doing up there. I don't know, it's like, 
<laughs> it's burning over here, but then they're calling it black dirt. It's crazy. Best sweet tea you have in your life, I promise you. But you have nothing to compare to because you're from Minnesota, so it's not sweet tea. All I got is pure leaf. <laughs> pure leaf. Arizona. It doesn't even taste like tea. Yeah. It used to be a dollar. It used to be a dollar for this big Whoa. sweet tea. Now it's two. Well, I know, right? But I, that was a bargain. It looked like a gallon. Yeah. More than a guy needs in one sitting. Well, that was a good day's worth of work. It's absolutely gorgeous here right now. It's like 70 degrees and sunny. It lo literally doesn't get any better than this. So. Average work day here in Southeast Florida, wherever we are, somewhere in, in the South, where it's nice and warm. Uh, anyway, um, that's all I got for you guys to see in this video. I figured I'd take you along 
for just a a little uh, little adventure that I figured it'd be a lot of fun. So just kind of see what the dirt world is like down here in the south, since I've never really seen that part. I've been down here a few times, but never for any work related stuff. So as always, thanks so much for watching, guys. Let me know if you like this kind of video. If you like to see like a little a little travel, uh, doing stuff a little different than uh, in my normal stomping ground. So. So let me know what you thought of this video in the comments below. And as always, thanks so much for watching. And remember, in order to get results no one else is getting, you gotta do things no one else is doing. See you on the next one.